Hello everybody and welcome back. Last episode, the Blackwolds attacked Archit and unfortunately Captain Brackenbrook was killed by Calder Caw, but Calder didn't live much longer after that. Bellany saw to that for sure. <laughs> uh, we picked up some quests from the town and the townspeople are going to start rebuilding and we have some tasks to do this morning. Um, we're going to bury some dead uh, bodies. We're going to kill, kill us some boars and get a nice bow upgrade. And uh, then we need to defeat some spiders. Um, I guess according to my map, it's going to kind of lead us to where we need to go to get these, I guess, get these boars first. But I think uh, the one of the dead bodies is over there where the sheep were. Let's find a boar. Like, here's one. Oh, I guess he is aggro. <laughs> That's my bad. I was uh, thinking that they would be red, like they are in some of the other games I play. I do. Like I say, it's been years and years since I've played this game, so there's a lot that needs to get back to me, I guess. All right. Okay. Now, this is something new, this deed. And uh, what it is, I do know what the deeds are. They're a way to get XP and you get traits. And sometimes you get some really nice rewards. So by killing that boar, apparently... Uh, it was one of the uh, skills that I have, um, quick shot. So each time I use quick shot, I guess I get a chance to uh, further this deed along. And when I get done, I will get the uh, the Lotro points, which is very exciting. Speaking of the points, uh, being as free to play, these points are going to be very important to me because. That's how I'm going to be able to unlock a lot of things in the game. However, I do plan on purchasing VIP coming up here uh, soonish. And it's my understanding that it will also assist me in perhaps unlocking some bag spaces and such. So I want to go ahead and give it a try. Uh, unfortunately, my budget doesn't allow me to subscribe for months on end, but we're definitely going to do that in the near future. In the meantime, we're going to definitely want to work on these deeds and get them whenever we can. Let's go ahead and get these boars out of the way. stand there. <laughs> I guess I was out of range for him. Alright, two more. Got that completed. Now let's look for the bodies that we need. Yeah, here's Dirk. He fell to a blade. Oh, I didn't read that in time. That was my bad. Okay, uh, let's see. Nate Whisperwind, was that the one? Oh, that's the one, that's the uh, hunter one. 
So let's go get that before we get too far away. Oh! Where's he going in such a hurry? <laughs> Now I've got some... I'm diseased. I think I can use that and I'm not diseased anymore. It's a crafting experience bonus weekend. Oh, that's something I'm look looking forward to is doing the crafting. I'm not sure. We're going to do the tutorial for sure uh, on camera. I don't know about the actual crafting itself because I don't recall uh, what it entails. So we're going to see, uh, but that's going to be down the road just a bit. As you will notice, I'm not a, a, a go, 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 run, run, quick, quick kind of a player. I like to take my time and enjoy Enjoy the story and take in all of the ambiance and all of that. There's no need to rush. The world is a crazy place enough as it is. Okay, now I'm not sure. Okay, the arrow's kind of pointing me this way. You know, I have to say the graphics are really amazing. Even the reflections in the water, the still calm water of the stars is just very clear. It looks very awesome. Oh, there's Nate. Nate fell to a blade while valiantly standing against the black walled brigands. Okay, so now we need to get to the to the farm. And I don't know if there's any black waltz over that way. Still, I would imagine there is. So, let's see. The farm is kind of that direction, but we're going to play it safe. how far the aggro would be. I want to test it. I think I have to be fairly close. Yeah, it's not too bad. I should be able to get past all of these guys. Oh. through this field. <laughs> I gotta take a screenshot, sorry. Gots to gots to. There we go. Okay, let's see. One thing I really like in this game, um, not every game does it, is they give individual names to all of the NPCs. They're not just, you know, Sergeant of Archit. It's, you know, Sergeant Redroot. That's awesome. Okay, let's see. Um. I think I'm... 
Oh, there he is over there, Will Wheatley. I knew he was nearby because my arrow went away. Let's get this bear out of the way. At least you're with your father now. Let's uh, head on over to the farm, which is over there. Let's get the let's get the wolf. Spiders from here. What is this? Oh, I got another deed. Blind sight. Okay. That's that's wonderful because those are passive deeds. I don't have to really grind anything so much to do that. All right, so now at the farm here, we're looking for a seed bag, a strong box, and a bow. Uh, and I got another one, Spider Slayer. See, we'll get points, we'll get, uh, I don't know what that is. A title or maybe and then we'll get reputation okay oh that sound that they make when they walk that squishy sound <laughs> killing me oh. It's not going to tell me where they are, so we need to look. Let's, uh... Oh, crap. Are you going to attack me? No? Oh, cool. Well, maybe the lurkers are not. I see something up there. Okay. We've got a strong box. Oh, the bow. Okay. Okay, and there's something sparkling over here. Aha. Uh -huh. Well, that's everything we needed. So let's get out of Dodge here. I'm going to hang out with these bloody spiders any longer than I have to. I have a feeling I'm going to be fighting more of them. Because if he's going to want to get back to his farm, we are going to have to eradicate the queen or whatnot, I'm guessing. I don't know. To, um, to Constable Thistlewolf first get my bow. What do you need? Oh, you've taken care of the poor blighted creatures. Every boar that has caught that foul plague will in the end have to be destroyed. But the few you've dealt with will slow the spread. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Fantastic. Let's see. Uh, let's, what's this? And 
another deed? Complete quest. Okay. <laughs> Alright, let's get all of our loot. Hello, John. What do you need? Good, it's done. Those men died bravely and deserved a proper burial. Once more, Archit is in your debt. Before you leave, there's something I must tell you. A queer man came through Archit while you were away, and I believe he was looking for you. A queer man? Okay, any more information like what he looked like or anything? What can I do? No. Oh. I can now gain a hobby. Oh, fantastic. And I've learned my first trait point. Okay. Oh, here we go. You now have the ability to ride a basic steed. Okay. Fantastic. Okay. And Middle Earth is a massive place. And I have my map. Okay. All right, we have a prologue here. Oh, here we go. He's going to tell us more about this, this person. The man who came through the village, he reminded me of Strider in his behavior, and he was looking for the hero of Archit. I can only assume that he spoke of you. He said the matter was most urgent, and that if I saw you, I was to direct you to the Combe and Waddle Inn, where he will be waiting for you. The Combe and Waddle is in the center of Combe to the south. He seemed most grim to me. I would travel to Combe immediately and speak with the innkeeper, Lisbeth Honeymead. She should know where to find this man. Okay, I will do that. Thank you, John. Okay, now we need to turn in the stuff to Cal. What do you need? This is everything we asked for, all right. My seed bag, strong box, and my father's trusty bow. I can't thank you enough, Bellany. And I must beg your pardon for treating you so poorly earlier. Had I known what was to become of my farm, I would have heeded your advice and retreated to Archie at once, saving ourselves a great deal of trouble. Poor Henry's life. Still, I'm glad we can make a new start. Tell the spider bane he has my thanks as well for sending you to us. Oh, you're welcome, Cal. I hope you can get your farm back, running and all that. Stay a moment. Them spiders have let my work hands driven me and Holly out of our home. There's got to be some way to get them off our land. I would think Atlee might know more about spiders than I do. Yeah, he does. He's quite an expert. Perhaps you should speak with him again. We can't return home until those awful things are gone. All right. <laughs> had a feeling you were going to send me to do something there. Okay, I can help you out, I suppose. Hello, Abby. Captain Brackenbrook was young when I saw him. Men age so swiftly here. Well, sometimes they do that when they're under a lot of a stress and such. What do you want? Good, you returned. It seems there's much more going on here than I first thought. While you were away, my cousin Bally arrived, and I sent him to search some caves in the ruins outside the East Walla Archit. A few of the hunters had dropped a huge stone in front of the cave, and I wanted him to ensure that the stone remained there. He is not yet returned, and I'm worried. Now, from what you told me of Spridley's troubles, the spiders came up through the cellar in his shed. Perhaps seeing the cave blocked off, they tunneled up through there. Okay. Um, so there's two entrances, perhaps. So I have to search for Bally. So, okay, let me think. I don't want more trade slots, thank you. I haven't even got the ones I've got. Maybe I better do that real quick here. 
Um, okay. So I can choose between increasing range damage or increases damage for skills that consume focus. I think I want that one. Because I think a lot of my stuff consume focus. That'll work for me. All right, well, we need to look for Bally, and we're going to go out the east wall here, like he mentioned, and see if he even made it to the cave or not. Because we have no idea. Let's see if this guy is active. Just kind of, oh, I bet the ambusher is. I gotta know. Yeah, the ambusher's an aggro. So we're gonna hit that, and then we're gonna try this one. Nice. Okay, so we need to stay clear of the ambushers. ambushers because they hide well, I think. Oh, there's Bally over there. Oh, crap. Just pop, dude. Search Bally's corpse and find a journal with several pages missing. The journal reads, I would not believe it, but the spiders have pushed the cave mouth clear. I entered the cave, and the spiders reacted to me instantly as if drawn to me. I'm unsure why. I spent my day carefully searching near the entrance and found several corpses bound into cocoons. These spiders seemed to wrap up everything. I'll write more tomorrow when I go further into the cave. Perhaps it would be best to enter the cave to see if I can find the rest of his journal. So it looks like when he came outside, he was ambushed. All right, so we need to go into the cave. Uh, oh, dear. <laughs> All righty, here we go. There's a cocoon right there, but I want to check. I want to check this way real quick. Can I hug the left wall? So I keep from getting lost. Oh. Yep. All of these are going to be aggro. get all three at once. I think I'll be alright, but you just don't know. Okay, I could probably take on two.
Oh! Oh crap, that scared me. <laughs> There's another cocoon that way. A spider hatchling. I wonder if we're getting close to where the queen is. I don't know if I want to deal with that just yet. Uh, well, we still need to get three more journals. Let's see if there's a page in here. Because I know there was one back by the entrance. Okay, that's going to be where the queen is, I bet. So I'm not going there. Let's go back and look for the cocoons. Going the other direction. So we'll continue to hug the wall. Oh. There's another door here. Or something. So we're not going to go in there either. I'm looking for a cocoon. No, I don't. Oh! Those trappers creeping me out. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna uh we're gonna leave that one there. Oh, we're gonna go. I wanna get back to the beginning. Let me go back the way I came here. Uh That was the way I came in. So I see a cocoon down there. Okay, so can I go around? Okay, I'm gonna have to fight you.
see a cocoon over there. Okay, we need one more cocoon. Fantastic! I completed that deed. For the spiders. Fantastic. Got points? And a title. Spider foe. Make that active. Yes, please. Thank you. going back the way I was. Yeah, this is not the way. I don't believe. 
believe. Yeah. Okay, so now I am surrounded. <laughs> Lovely. This is not where I want to be. Uh, okay, here we go. Don't die here, gang. Okay then. Well, we leveled up. Or something. What happened? Yeah, we're level eight. Awesome. Okay. Focus. Before combat. Okay, I'm gonna have to look at that. I don't wanna be here. I know that there's no cocoons in here. We need to find one more. Uh, let's go. I don't know if this is the way we went before. And it was lit up. There's one. Okay. Okay, fantastic. Now, to get out of here quickly, I am just going to call back. I am not going to run through this. <laughs> are back in arch it let's go and talk to uh atley bring him bally's journal i'm back bali i i'm so sorry well met i can't believe it bali gone he must be avenged and this journal tells me what is behind this a spider queen from the blue mountains she and her brood must have followed me from Thorn's halls. Know this. Even if I am slain, she will never leave this place. She has found easy prey here. We have to destroy her, or Archit shall become a new abode for the Queen. Okay. Well, that is an upgrade. So we definitely Might want Might you to lend me an ear? Ooh, I need to empty my bag soon. Okay. This spider queen, Ironace by name, and her ways are known to me. She will have hidden herself in Sprigley's house and blocked all the entrances save one. If you search the tunnels below the house, I would wager you will find a hidden passage leading to her lair. The vile thing must be slain, or Archit will be overrun by her brood. Would that I were hale and could heft an axe. 
but that time has passed. Now, the mantle of the spider bane must pass to you. If you'll have it, I wish you well facing her. Oh, thank you. I'm, I am looking forward to it. <laughs> so let's go do that real quick. I'm not going to pick up any other quests at the moment. Okay, I think that there was like a cellar door or something out at the farm. I remember seeing that. So we're going to run out there. See if that doesn't take us closer to where her lair is. I really don't want to have to go through all of those spiders again in that cave. So let's see. Okay, let's see. Hopefully we can still get in through that cellar. I think it was over here to the right. No? Yes. Oh crap. Well, it didn't take, well, maybe. Maybe we're closer. We need to go find those babies where the spider young ends are. Do my focus. Got her. Is there any way out of here, or do I have to go? Thank God. 
Now we're going back to Atley. want? Many seeds did the Dreadweaver sow throughout our mountains. Because of you, another of those seeds has passed from the world. I owe you a great debt for Iron Aid's death and for my life. Accept this reward and with it, the friendship of Atlee Spiderbane. See if this helm is any better looking than the one I had before. So let's see, I have to remember how to do this. No. <laughs> uh yeah, that's that's not much better. I think we'll leave the helm off for now. Well, thank you for joining me today, everybody. Please give me a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Next episode, we're going to be moving on to Combi, it looks like. And uh, I'm very excited to see what happens with this story. So take care, all. See you next time. Bye-bye.